Uh, a few announcements that we will knock out real quick. Uh, Bring Your Own Craft Night begins Thursday, August 15th at 6.30. So Lori Hinman is in charge of that. I know there were a couple questions, so if we can find her, just ask her. But women primarily are in, involved in this, along with it's open to all women and youth included, is what my notes say. So please um, come along for that. This weekend, we're going to begin our collection of paper goods and utensils and that kind of stuff for Sidewalk Sunday School, one of the events that we, or one of the programs we sponsor, a ministry. Uh, so plastic forks, spoons, plates, napkins, paper towels, those kind of things for them. And on the 25th, and 24th and 25th, Pastor Ed, who leads that, will also be giving us the message that day, kind of sharing with us how the ministry has been and what it's been doing so we get a, a feel for how we are supporting that ministry. So we're looking forward to that. Um, food closet, definitely need food. Green beans, corn, other cans of vegetables, grab anything you got because we're, we're starting to see because of school kick, ticking in, there's a little bit of a push now for, for extra food. So uh, sometimes, we, I mean, we order it, but we, get, we need some replenishing at this point. So we want to go ahead and, and bring what we can for that. That's awesome. Uh, the bulletin has some information about the backpacks. We want to make sure that we just reaffirm what we've talked about the last few weeks. Everything is due this week, if not today. Um, what we do need are drivers for Saturday morning at 9 o'clock. If you've got about a half an hour or so, you can give us. Um, we'll have them all packed. Everything will be ready to go. And then we just drive them to where they need to be. So that's a great piece to help us out. Uh, next Sunday is going to feature our school. We're going to have our big school. We'll have some kids uh, singing, leading some pieces of worship. And Randy Gast, our, our head of school, will be giving the message that day. So we're looking forward to that. We'll install both the Early Learning Center staff and the teacher staff as well at both of the services. And finally, in your pews, you will also see the kickoff cards. They're tiny little cards that we've had that we would love for you to pass around. Um, but just to give every... We, we announced it last week for the first time, but... If you weren't here, on the 8th of September, we are having one service at 10 o'clock together, all joined outside in the parking, the, the separate parking lot on the other side here. Pray for great weather, because we, we do have backup plans. We'll all be back in here and everything, but um, it's, it's our annual pit beef sale that goes along with that, so if you want to order those, you can do that ahead of time, but we're going to have bouncy houses. We're going to have, what else are we having? The what? Oh, Kona Ice, yes, they'll be here. Joppa Magnolia fire trucks will be here. Um, it's it's going to be a good time. For those who are worried, the game starts at 1. We're going to have a big screen. It'll be there. So you can still stay, not rush home. You can get home at halftime. All right? They play the Dolphins anyway. It's no big deal. All right, so just letting you know, we're going to really, really do this thing big. Um, we'd love for everyone to show up and bring somebody with you just to experience what community uh, truly looks like. And so that'll be outdoors, and we're definitely looking forward to it.